Hey everybody and welcome back to a brand new video where today we're going to be talking about some new Dingarumpa news that just came out. Uh, it came out on October 16th and this video should be coming out October 18th or 19th. It was only a couple days ago so it's kind of brand new. And you know, I guess it's kind of important because well, not a lot of Dingarumpa news happens nowadays so I thought it'd be a good way to cover it, especially since it's getting quite popular on like social media and I've had a lot of people send this to me. So uh, we'll just take a look at it. Make sure to like the video and subscribe to the channel, you know I have to say this in every video, do apologise but it's just how YouTube is, and make sure to comment down below what you think of the video. Either way, we have a tweet here from Go Nintendo Tweet that says Dingarumpa creator Kadaka is open to returning to the series. So now this links to an article, and I'm just gonna go reading the article right now. So it says Dingarumpa creator Kadaka is stepping away from the franchise for a bit to work on Rain Code, which is uh, Kadaka's new game that's coming out. Many people were surprised to Kadaka turn to something different instead of a fresh new Dingarumpa installment, but in a new interview we found out why that's the case. A company called Twinfinity, or Twin In... something like that, I do apologise. Either way, they interviewed Kadaka to find out what pushed him to move away from Dingarumpa for the time being, and it turns out that he was just interested in trying something new. That being said, he's certainly open to returning to Dingarumpa at some point down the line, so here's the actual quote from the actual interview. Kodaka says, I wanted to make a new IP and Spike Chunsoft wasn't pushing for a new Dingenrompa sequel, so I decided to go with it. To be honest, if I asked Spike Chunsoft whether I should make a new Dingenrompa title, they might say yes, so I didn't ask. It's not like I didn't want to make a new Dingenrompa game, but I have a lot of ideas and want to create something new. Someday I may go back, maybe. Dingaromper is more of a niche game, and now I'm working on a bigger one, but it'd be cool if I go back to Dingaromper at some point afterward. So uh, here's the thing, a lot of people are kind of, I don't want to say overblowing this, but a lot of people are kind of overhyping this as like, oh, this definitely could mean a return to Dingaromper, or like, Dingaromper coming back. But I don't really think that is the case. I think if that is going to happen, it's going to take many, many years from now, who knows? Spike Chunsoft, honestly, with how they're dealing with Dingaromper, they clearly have no idea what they want to do with the series, which is why Dingaromper S ended up so poorly. And obviously, I'm not saying that you need Kadaka to make another Dingaromper game, but you know, his guidance would help, especially with what happened with Dingaromper S, and well, especially what's happening with no news. However, from what Kadaka says in this interview, he says that Spike Chunsoft wasn't pushing for a Dingaromper game, which I find quite odd. It's a bit weird to me that, you know, Spike Chunsoft didn't want a new one, especially with how a company works, you know, a company kind of wants to push out as much stuff as they can. So it's quite interesting to see that Spike Chunsoft told him, no, let's take a break. Uh, I'm not exactly sure why. Either way, it has been many, many years since Dingaromper, so hopefully Kadaka might come back and make a new game. Whether that be a sequel, whether that be a spin-off game, I don't mind. More Dingaromper would be great. And, uh, you know, it would be cool to add some, or it would be cool to cover some news about it. I just thought I may well cover this in this video, or like make a video on it, because a lot of people are hyping it up, a lot of people are talking about it, and plus I've been sent this about a million times, so I'm, I'm like, I may as well cover it, right? Because, uh, you know, I do discussion videos, news, a skit, a skits? <laughs> Either way, uh, I do appreciate y'all for watching. Let me know in the comments what you think about this. Again, in my opinion, I don't think this confirms anything really. If anything, this just kind of says, oh, he might make a new game in like four years from now, but that's a maybe. <laughs> Either way, I hope you all did enjoy this video and enjoyed the news. Have a lovely rest of your day, and I'll see you on the next video. Bye-bye!